Today we're going to talk about how to upgrade your Dell Venue Pro from 8 gig or whatever it's got on it to 32 gig. Uh, do not do this unless you want to void your warranty or take a chance of breaking your phone. With that, really don't do this at all. I'm strongly recommending you don't because bad things could happen. But if you do want to see how to do it, here's how we're going to do it. The first step is to get a 32 gig micro SD card. I had no clue about which brands were certified to work with Windows Phone. Uh, basically, I took a gamble, went up to Amazon, found the biggest one clearly labeled a Class 6. Wound up with a computer bay card costing about $60. Step two, protect yourself. Your phone's going to get wiped. All your data's going to be lost. It's going to go back to factory uh, status, uh, at least as far as the operating system's concerned. So back off any pictures or whatever you can using the Zoom client software. Third step is to get the phone ready. You're going to have to pop the battery fairly quickly during this process. Go ahead and open the back of the phone by sliding it up with your thumbs and pulling it up. And you can then take out the battery when you need to. But we're going to go ahead and get the phone ready for that. The fourth step is the key one. We're going to reset the phone. Go into settings, about, and then tap reset the phone. You get a confirmation message. Click through it. Uh, when the Dell logo comes up after the reboot, at that point, you want to yank the battery out. If you go past that, well, the results may vary. But when that Dell logo is up after the reboot, after you reset the phone, that is the point you want to yank the battery out. Fifth step is to remove the existing card. Uh, once the battery is out, look on the uh, upper right side on the back of the phone. You'll see a small, very well hidden black piece of tape. It covers the micro SD card slot. Peel off the tape and then use a pocket knife or something like that to pry out the micro SD card that's in there. Uh, my old card was a class 4 sand disk. Save this card. If you have problems, simply put the 8 gigabyte card back in the device and you should be uh, good to continue with a normal reset of the phone. Sixth step is basically to just insert the new micro SD card. Step seven, reboot the phone. Put the battery back in, turn the power on, the phone will reinitialize. It should be back to factory state. You'll be good to go. Go into settings about, check the memory, or use Zoom and check the memory, and you'll see a happy 32 gigabyte phone.